Senator Roberts. Thank you. The Albanese government is making secret cuts to infrastructure projects. Twice now, the Senate has passed my motion, forcing the government to hand over the full infrastructure review they used to justify cutting hundreds of millions of dollars in projects. Twice, the government has opposed transparency and accountability about its secret infrastructure cuts. How many more times will the Labor government keep secrets from Australian taxpayers? This is the Labor review that concluded Emu Swamp Dam at Stanthorpe should be cancelled. Only three years ago, this southern Queensland town, in severe drought, ran dry. They had to cart in millions of litres of water by truck just to survive. Up to 50 trucks carried, carted water hundreds of kilometres every day for 15 months. On what basis did the Labor government conclude Stanthorpe doesn't deserve a dam? We might never know. The government has so far refused to hand over their review that justifies the decision. If Stanthorpe doesn't have water, Stanthorpe will die. The Labor government needs to answer why they believe Stanthorpe should be left to die in the next drought, literally hung out to dry. One Nation will keep fighting for those answers and we will fight for more dams across Queensland. What we need in Australia is productive infrastructure to build our competitive advantage, our productive competitiveness. We need dams that agriculture can use to boom. We need cheap power from which the entire economy will benefit. We need functional roads that don't have potholes big enough to destroy a car suspension. Australia needs visionary nation-building projects, infrastructure projects like the Iron Boomerang. Right now, every year, we send 900 million tonnes of iron ore and 360 million tonnes of coal overseas, ship it overseas. Those are two essential ingredients to make steel that we largely import. We put that dirt on a boat, places like China buy it, they turn it into steel, they make things like unproductive wind turbines out of the steel, put them on a boat and ship the wind turbines back to Australia in the form of steel when our dopey government buys it off them. We should let private enterprise build the iron boomerang track linking our iron ore and coal mines so we can make the steel right here in this country. Government doesn't even have to build iron boomerang. They just have to promise they won't get in the way and then private money will pay for it. That money is already knocking on the door. These are the kind of nation building pro in infrastructure projects that would be on the horizon if one nation had our way. We certainly wouldn't be cutting productive infrastructure like dams in secret as the Labor government is doing. Before all of that, we need accountable and transparent government. Labor continues to prove it will never be transparent. Your secret infrastructure cuts are just the latest example of a government that's afraid of explaining itself Thank to you, the Senator voters. Roberts.